So this is a... Uh, first world problems. Yeah, I know. First world problems, right. This is a HP 7550A, not the B, it's the A, unfortunately. So we turn it on, it says load paper to plot. We hit auto feed and then load. It's gonna pull a sheet of paper out of the tray, hopefully. Maybe. Here it goes. <laughs> okay, so now I think it's loaded. So now we go into next, next, and then demo. I believe I just hit this one. Demo part, here we go. People just don't think that this is actually real. And I believe, so this is how they did fills with a pen. But it's really neat when, you, when it starts getting into a, a place where it has to skip because it's going to put something else in there later. You'll see it here in a second. Really fast lifting up of the pen. Isn't that crazy? That's cool. And it's got a sharp edge. The, the plotter will actually do 1,000 DPI. Oh, it's, it's, it gets better, don't worry. Obviously, as the line segment gets shorter. Which colors. So now it's going to do a crosshatch pattern. Also with a gap, right? Wow. Isn't that crazy? Get another color? Yeah, green. Oh. It's getting black. Wow. <laughs> That's actually supposed to be a thicker black, but I only have one thickness. So now it's writing notes the years oh, on there, right? Oh, look at that. That's so awesome. This is a built-in font, I believe. It has like 19, uh, something like that. And then it does a, um, a graphics plot on the right side where it's filling in. And it would be so great to have one of these and deliberately program it so it makes constant spelling errors that has to <laughs> scratch them out and redo them. And Hummingbird's wings. That's why I said I want to do it at 120. Yeah. It'll do, it'll do uh, 120 and 1080, right? I don't know. Let's see. I think it does. Otherwise, you can return it. I, I just got. <laughs> no, it, it will. It, it will. Oh. And the last one is just solid. Like it's already drying out. So that's wow. it. Wow. Pretty cool, huh? Yep, that's water. 